Hello friends and family and good morning from Universal Studios City Walk. I thought it'd be fun to come out today, head over to the main Universal Studios store right here on City Walk. Islands of Adventure is celebrating 25 years, which is really crazy. Lots of brand new merchandise there, but they have an entire section of all of the merchandise from Wizarding World of Harry Potter. They have Simpsons, Hello Kitty, Jurassic Park, a little bit of everything. I'm excited to be here. But before we get started, if you would subscribe and click the bell notification so you're aware of future uploads and live streams, we would greatly appreciate it. I did want to point out the beautiful view here at City Walk this morning. It is not busy like at all. The weather is incredible, about 75 degrees. Not too many people out and about though. Before we do head over to the main Universal Studios store, I do want to mention, if you are interested in any of the merchandise in today's video, definitely check out our Patreon page. I'll add a link to that in the description box. It's so hard to believe though, Islands of Adventure is already celebrating 25 magical years here in Central Florida. Important to mention, the old Universal Studios Legacy Store, like all of the signage has been taken down, like the storefront. I'm really excited to see what shop is going to come in here. Hopefully some really cool Epic Universe merchandise. All right, let's head on over to the main Universal Studios store. The great thing about coming here and doing your shopping, you don't need a park ticket. All you have to do is pay to park. But if you do come after 6 p.m., parking is completely free. You can enjoy all of Universal City Walk has to offer. I feel like just days ago, all of the merchandise up front here was all Universal Studios Mardi Gras. But how about all the new happenings here, all the new merchandise? I like what they're doing here with the luggage. They have a brand new fan. This is part of that brand new collection I was saying. Kong, Skull Island, Autobots, E.T., Hogsmeade. Definitely perfect for the parks and the warmer weather. Those are $18 a piece. Underneath there is the matching beach towel part of this collection. It does have like all of the same design. But look at this, it's already on sale. Three beach towels for $66, normally $28 a piece. Over here is the adult size tank top with that same design. You got some churros, ET, the Universal Studios logo, $27 for them. Let's see what we got doing. It looks like they do have a backpack. This has a little rubberized patch here for Universal Studios. A couple good size zipper compartments with the mesh netting on the sides as well. These aren't lounge fly, but only $55. From this new collection is a brand new kids graphic t-shirt. It says no two shirts are exactly the same. These are $25 a piece and yet another shirt that I haven't seen before. Again this one here is adult size. I like it how it has the washed look though. This is really unique. $30 a piece for them. And then right over here is a very large size 3D effect coffee mug. These are $22, but all of like the different things jump out. Every day is a turkey leg day, Volcano Bay, ET, we have Kong on there, a little bit of everything. The handle almost looks like a churro. And then over here is yet another adult size graphic t-shirt. Again, not no two garments are exactly the same. That is $30. And it looks like they do have a brand new full zip hoodie here. Even more items part of this brand new merchandise collection. This is a new notebook but all of these are like little patches on the front. These are $28. It does zip close and it says Universal Studios on the opposite side and perfect to get some of your items home. They do have these reusable tote bags. The strap says Universal Studios with that really cool design. You can't go wrong with these. Only $4 a piece. 
for $20. Also some matching socks, part of this collection. Stay hydrated at Volcano Bay. Summer vibes only. Universal Studios, Hogsmeade. And they do have some brand new autograph books. It's neat though because these do also come with the ink pen. Just like Disney, there's lots of character interactions and meet and greets. These are $15 a piece. And then right over here is a small little notepad with this design. It does come with a little elastic strap here to keep it closed for $13. Celebrating 25 years at Universal's Islands of Adventure is a very nice size limited edition pin. It has the little sticker there, the entrance way to IOA, the dueling dragon, Spider-Man, Cat in the Hat. These are $15 a piece. That is a perfect way to commemorate IOA. Here's a graphic t-shirt with that same design as the pins. Again with Cat in the Hat, the light tower, the uh, sleeve here does say Universal Studios Islands of Adventure 25 years. These are $27. And just like the pin in the adult size t-shirt, they do have a stainless steel cup. Experience the adventure 25 years at Universal's Islands of Adventure. But that really cool design wraps around the entire thing. It does have a clear lid on the top. These are $27. The great thing about this store though, they do sell merchandise literally both for Islands of Adventure and Universal Studios side. So they have a little bit of everything here. I do want to show some of the plushies. It's awesome that they still keep Shrek going strong. Like the Gingerbread Man uh, plushies are $17. Right up ahead from Shrek you do have Donkey, $15. Like look at his big teeth though. Very nice attention to detail. And here's some smaller plushies that they do have with Shrek and Fiona. Those are $15 dollars but you do have let's see here okay a plushie with uh, Princess Poppy that is $35 actually a bunch of different plushies here from Trolls let's pop over though and check out some of the Despicable Me and Minions merchandise that they do have how cool are these unicorn slippers these are super duper soft like I like the eyes all the different attachments and attention to detail those are $25 a piece they even have a huge unicorn very very fluffy plushie I'm trying to find the price here. Those are $35. Lots of unicorn merchandise. Look at this. They even have the uh, fluffy throw blankets. This has the Sherpa on the opposite side and it's sparkly. Yeah, that's really cool with a tie-dye pattern. And it looks like they also have a fluffy uh, Funko Pop that's a Universal Studios exclusive from Despicable Me. Let's see if we can get one of these guys out to show you. Yeah, that's cool. It has a little sticker for Universal Studios product. Those are $22. And then right next door is even more of your Minions merchandise. This is an adult size pullover hoodie with a huge graphic on the front side for $60. On the sleeve though, it even says Despicable Me, Minions Mayhem, Universal Studios. There's also a good assortment of different Minions plushies. These are a very generous size. Look at them there holding the little plushy teddy bear for $30. And speaking of teddy bear, you can even purchase the little plushie plushy teddy bears. Look at the little facial expression though with the tongue sticking out. $20 for that. And then over here for the Minions collection, they do have a very nice coffee mug. This one's a good size. Look at the big smiley face. It has the goggles. These are $27 a piece, but it even says Despicable Me Minion Mayhem on the backside. There's even a cat in the hat section and they're running a deal on these oversized coffee mugs that say Universal Studios on the inside. These are two for $29, normally $19 a piece. Really neat that they're running some outlet prices at Universal Studios. Here's an adult size full zip hoodie. Look at this with the Globe Universal Orlando Resort with the a hat on top. These are $55. The backside though is really awesome. Look at all the characters again. Again you have the cat in the hat, Universal Orlando Resort. Resort. And then right next door is your uh, classic graphic t-shirt, pretty much with the same design. Those are $30, and you can never go wrong with a Thing 1 and Thing 2 graphic t-shirt. These actually have like your spirit jersey raised lettering, and it says Universal Studios at the bottom. These are both $30 a piece. Let's check out some more of your merchandise here for Thing 1 and Thing 2. How about this huge photo frame? It holds a 4x6 photo and it says Universal's Islands of Adventure on the back side. That's actually only $15. I feel like that's a really good deal. Over here is another coffee mug. Actually looks like it's two coffee mugs in one. They say Thing 1 and Thing 2 and it has two handles. Definitely very unique. These are $19. 
even a really good selection of Hello Kitty plushies. This is your classic Hello Kitty. $21.95 with her little bow on the top. Definitely very, very soft. How about this Hello Kitty plushie that they do have? Probably twice the size and only $25. One of my favorite things with Hello Kitty though is all of the collaborations. These plushies that they do have with all like the classic universal attractions. Like you have Hello Kitty in a Jaws costume. These are $25 and she still has her bow. Right underneath for Jurassic Park, you do have the Hello Kitty Jurassic Park collection where she's in the T-Rex costume. Underneath there, one of my favorite attractions and movies of all time is Back to the Future, so that is really cool to see. And underneath there, my current favorite attraction at Universal Studios is definitely the E.T. Adventure Ride. They do have the uh, Hello Kitty plushie. And literally just one section over is a whole slew of different Simpsons merchandise. Now this one's not a lounge fly backpack, but it's very nice simulated leather with the uh, straps on the back. You have all of the characters and then the half-eaten big pink donut. These are $65 and you can purchase the big pink over at the uh, studio side. I highly suggest you check that out. They do have a pack of two different Simpsons hair scrunchies for $18. And speaking of big pink, how about this huge bucket hat that they have. It says The Simpsons. These are $30 a piece. I do want to show you the really awesome coffee mug that they do have though. This is incredible. You can actually see through it with Homer Simpson and it says Universal Studios on the inside. Those are $19. Of course, you can't go to Simpsons Land without checking out the awesome Duff Beer merchandise. This is a huge plastic cup. You can actually put this in the freezer. You can see like all the ice crystals for Duff Beer. These are $15 a piece. They do have your classic graphic t-shirts here for Simpsons and Duff Beer. A very, very soft material for $33. I do want to come over here to the opposite side and see what we got doing. We have binge, uh, let's see here, responsibility with all the different and Duff beers. That is $30 and they do even have an entire huge plushie of like a Duff beer can for $30. Even more merchandise over in the Simpsons section. This is a huge Homer Simpson baseball cap. It's embroidered the Simpsons going down the side. These are adult size for $26. Here's a huge graphic t-shirt as well. Like look how happy Homer looks. He must have just had a Duff beer. That is $27. And even more coffee mugs. I feel like the uh, Simpsons coffee mugs are incredible. Like look at this thing with Homer. And it says Universal Studios on the inside for $19. They even have a little selection of plushies here from SpongeBob SquarePants. Look at Plankton. His mouth is wide open. Everything is embroidered. He is $18.95. They even have a ginormous uh, SpongeBob plushie. He is massive, probably at least two feet tall. You can see his arms and legs dangling. $30 for him. Here's a much smaller version of SpongeBob though. Definitely easier to get home in your travels. $14.95. You can even purchase, oh my word, this is so awesome. I would definitely call this a pillow. It's a huge Krabby Patty. It says the Krusty Krab Special on the top, but this is so super duper soft for $22. Even a really good selection of lounge fly bags. This one's from Hello Kitty Scenario Collection. Again, with the simulated leather is incredible. These are $82 a piece with your classic Hello Kitty. Right underneath there is yet another offering with the uh, simulated leather. These are all $82. The quality is definitely there though. And you can use your annual pass holder discount on this merchandise. Here's some of your Minions uh, Villain Con backpacks. Again, this is another lounge fly. Look at the hair though on the top with the goggles, the embroidered teeth, and a little pocket on the front. He is $90. Underneath there, they do have SpongeBob uh, SquarePants. It says Nickelodeon Loungefly, but these are cool because you can move his arms and legs. Let's see the old price of Rooney on SpongeBob. Again, with the uh, simulated leather, SpongeBob is $82. And then over on the opposite side, they do have a bunch of your classic attractions, like the ET Adventure Ride uh, Loungefly bag. That one is $82. They do also have Back to the Future with the DeLorean, but you can move the time here and actually change that which is really neat. Underneath there is your Jurassic Park one with the uh, faux leather doors. You can actually open them up. You can see like the Funko Pop version of the T-Rex. They even have a whole assortment here of keychains from all around the park. They do have these little rubberized ones 
from Hello Kitty, a bunch of different characters. These are all $10 a piece. They have some metal versions with Hello Kitty. I like all the different attachments that you get though. With some uh, bows, you get Hello Kitty with her sunglasses. Let's check the price here. Those are $14. How about this though? Like you have Hello Kitty in Fast and Furious, Hello Kitty with the E.T. Adventure Ride. They have some Betty Boot merchandise as well. It says Attitude is Everything and Be Sassy. You can purchase this over at uh, Universal's Islands of Adventure or here at the main Universal store. They have the E.T. Uh, keychains. These are $14. Here's like that classic one here. They even have you covered with Wizarding World of Harry Potter keychains. How about this? This is an exact replica of Slughorn's Hourglass for $15. It even comes with a Wizarding World of Harry Potter metal attachment. Right next door you do have the Butterbeer version. These are very heavy like a pewter. Right next door is the Night Bus. Look at this though. You get an extra Clippy and Wizarding World of Harry Potter attachment for $17. I do also want to check out some of your Jurassic Park merchandise. This is a graphic t-shirt in adult size. It's actually sun activated. That is $33. Then right over here is a brand new crossbody bag. That's embroidered with your classic Jurassic Park insignia. These are $90 a piece. Okay, and it's lounge fly. It has a bunch of dinosaurs kind of like indented on the opposite side. And they do have a brand new 4x6 photo frame. This is the entranceway to Jurassic Park over at Islands of adventure this holds a four by six photo that one is twenty nine dollars right behind me is some really fun Jurassic World merchandise this has that 3d effect with the uh, t-rex on both sides those are nineteen dollars a piece with the matte black finish underneath there is the adult size uh, graphic hoodie this one's a pullover for fifty seven dollars it has the same design as the coffee mug and then they do also have the Jurassic World uh, Tervis tumblers with the rubberized ring. It does say Jurassic World on the one side for $29, but really nice quality. And they, underneath there is a Jurassic World uh, Kids Ringer t-shirt for $25. a bunch of Quidditch gear. They do have all four houses with the different baseball caps here. This is all the Hufflepuff versions with the big patch on the front. $27 for that one. Over here is your classic trucker hat with the Hufflepuff. It even has the, the uh, Hogwarts house crest there for Hufflepuff on the side. Those are $29. Even a good assortment of drinkware. It's definitely getting a little bit warm here in Central Florida. These water bottles are just perfect. $22 for that. It says Quidditch team captain. And right underneath there is the uh, matching uh, Quidditch Team Captain t-shirts for Hufflepuff. These are $37. Like I was saying though, they do have all four houses with this gear. Like the Gryffindor section has your trucker hat for $29. The same difference with the uh, Gryffindor caps as well with the uh, patch on the front for $27. I did want to mention though, they do have the Wizarding World of Harry Potter cooling rags. This is the Gryffindor version. They come in a plastic container. These are definitely perfect though for the uh, warmer weather. Those are $22 a piece. They even have a little kids version t-shirt with your Gryffindor Quidditch team. These are $33. On the other side of the rack is the Slytherin Captain shirts, and you should say uh, baseball caps. Again, these are very nice quality. They do also have the matching water bottles, the cooling rags there, and here is your Quidditch Team Captain shirt. It's really neat though because they do say like S for Slytherin on the sleeve. Those are $37. And then right behind there is a good assortment of other items, like these are those plastic cups that they do have. Only $10, or I should say they upped them to $12, okay. They used to be $10, Wizarding World of Harry Potter, Gryffindor. Those are really nice quality though. They do have all four houses. Of course, over here is the Hufflepuff version. It says Hufflepuff going down the side. And I did want to show you these really nice new pullover sweatshirts. These are embroidered with the Gryffindor logo. You have the house crest. These are $70 a piece. That's the adult size one. And here's like the kids version. Again, it's embroidered Gryffindor. You have the house pinstripe colors at the bottom. These are $50. And how about the adorable 
Gryffindor lion plushies that they have for the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Those are $25. On the opposite side of the rack is the Slytherin adult size pullover sweatshirt. Again, with the embroidered uh, logo here for Slytherin, you have the house crest. And how nice are these smaller size backpacks that they do have? Now, these ones aren't lounge fly, but it's the simulated leather with the metal badge for Slytherin on the front. You even get like a little fr frilly little ball there. These are $65. And then right up ahead is your Slytherin Wizarding World of Harry Potter plastic cups on the opposite side of the rack, though they do have the Ravenclaw plastic cups, your smaller size backpacks. Again, these are a great size for the theme parks. And underneath there, how about this plushie that they have for Ravenclaw, $25. Let's see what's going on a little bit further in here. So even more drinkware. These are really nice quality. They actually have the rubberized ring that goes around so you can hold it by. It has the clear lid and then your Gryffindor uh, house crest. That's actually a big metal badge. These are all $32 a piece, but they have Gryffindor, Slytherin, Ravenclaw, and then Hufflepuff. On the bottom section is like your Under Armour no sweat material. It says Quidditch established 1269 and then Team Captain on the sleeve. These are perfect for the warmer weather. $37 for that. And it looks like they do also have the matching adult size um, shorts here for this collection. Again, a super soft, breathable material. And then right up ahead are the matching socks. Again, they say Team Captain and then Quidditch. Let's see the old price of Rooney. Those are $17. You could even get some really fun Hogwarts alumni gear like this uh, trucker hat. It says Hogwarts alumni. And look at the opposite side there with the Hogwarts house crest. These are $27 a piece. Right underneath there is the full zip hoodie. It has that same design with Hogwarts alumni, the house crest on the front. But look at this, it's even embroidered with all four house color pinstripe. Let's see what we got here. Okay, so those don't have the price, but they do also have the matching uh, sweatpants to this design with the Hogwarts alumni, and then you also have the pinstriping. Those are $50. Let's see what we got here on the opposite side. So here's a very tall stainless steel cup with the Hogwarts alumni again. Then you have the house crest on the opposite side. Those are $25 a piece. Underneath there is a very heavy, almost like ceramic slate piece. This is a cool coaster. It has cork on the back side for $12. Another perfect addition to the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. How about this hardcover notebook with the Hogwarts house crest, all four houses. It even says Wizarding World of Harry Potter Universal on the back side, $24 for that. Here's your Hogwarts alumni. Very nice quality matte finish, like 3D effect coffee mugs. It has that same design on both sides though. Those are $21 and even have the uh, huge Hogwarts alumni banners for your wall. Like these aren't cheap at all, like very, very heavy material. Everything is embroidered and they even have the uh, matching uh, throw blankets. These are super duper heavy. It has that same Hogwarts alumni design. Here's a bunch of assorted merchandise that they do have and I love how they actually have like all four houses already separated. Let's pop on over to the Hufflepuff and we'll check out everything. So here is a very nice quality full zip hoodie. And again, look at this on the inside there. That whole design is really cool. You have a huge patch on the front with the badger and it says Hufflepuff. Those are $70. Right next door is the adult size graphic t-shirt. Again, with the badger, patience, dedication, and loyalty. You have Helga Hufflepuff's cup at the bottom. $37 for them. And it looks like they do have a couple different items here on the bottom section. This is very cool. It has that same design here. Dedication, uh, patience, loyalty, Hufflepuff. $20 for that and look at this like you can do like matching t-shirts like here's a kids graphic t-shirt and they do have like the same type of banners that they had like for the uh, Hogwarts alumni collection with the same design and right next door is all of your Ravenclaw merchandise like the matching full zip hoodie with the huge uh, patch there on the front these are again $70 a very heavy material I don't think you'll be needing this in Central Florida right now definitely the t-shirt though is a good purchase with them, you have learning and then wit with Ravenclaw's diadem at the bottom for $37 but they do have all the same merchandise for all four houses like your coffee mugs your kids t-shirts your banners and also these stainless steel cups again you can't go wrong with these especially for the theme parks it's very metallic it says Ravenclaw you do have the house crest 
These are $27. I did also want to mention you can get your pressed pennies here as well. A dollar for one or five dollars for all eight. They do have eight different designs in the bottom section. The opposite side of each of them does say Wizarding World of Harry Potter, but you have like platform nine and three quarters, Harry's glasses with the lightning bolt, the sorting hat, Dobby. Let's see here, we have the fire bolt and then the uh, Deathly Hollow symbol. And then right up ahead, you can even purchase the collector's coin album. Look at that with Hogwarts Castle. And you do get the first pressed penny penny, pressed penny penny, that says Wizarding World. These are $12. There's a good amount of different assorted items in this section and a cinch backpack is definitely way to go with the theme parks, especially if you're doing the water rides or really can't, uh, plan on purchasing anything. This has a big zipper compartment on the front. Of course, the Gryffindor version, they do have all four houses. These are $28 a piece. They do have your classic crossbody style bag. Look at this, it says keeper there in the zipper section, Gryffindor, and then you do have the lion. There's uh, two different zipper compartments though and a pouch on the backside. These are $45 a piece. And it looks like they do have some brand new baseball caps. Here is the uh, Gryffindor version with the embroidered pinstriping. It says Gryffindor on the backside, $27. Right next door is your uh, Slytherin version. Like I was saying though, they do have like the matching uh, crossbody styles bags for all four houses. Those are $45. Right underneath there is the cinch backpack for Slytherin, but they got so much cool. Uh, different merchandise in this section. These are $28 a piece. A really nice card holder. It's fuzzy on the inside. You can put four cards on the right hand side and it has extra compartments. Look at this though. It almost looks like a Hogwarts luggage. They do have all four houses. Ravenclaw, you have your Gryffindor, you have uh, Let's see here, Ravenclaw and then Hufflepuff and of course Gryffindor on the opposite side. Right over here is your classic ringer tee. Again, Hufflepuff, Gryffindor, Slytherin and Ravenclaw. This is a very breathable material. Very, very soft for $37. Let's check out some of the high socks that they do have. Looks like they have Slytherin, Ravenclaw and Hufflepuff. They're missing Gryffindor at the moment, but those are $17. And right up ahead are definitely some of the best quality throw pillows I've seen in a theme park. These are all $30. $37 a piece. They do have all four houses. The first one here is the Gryffindor one, but they're actually double sided. Like you can see the lion, the Gryffindor logo on the back side. Right next door is the Slytherin version. Look at this with the snakes, the Slytherin logo. You can't go wrong with any of these though. And you can use your annual pass discount, of course. It says Ravenclaw on the back side, and Hufflepuff is really neat. For $13, you could even purchase some of your Wizarding World of Harry Potter patches, which would be perfect for a backpack or a t-shirt. This is the uh, Quidditch one established 1269 with Gryffindor. They have Slytherin, Ravenclaw, and then Hufflepuff. And right underneath there, how cool is this? It says Quidditch Chaser, they have Quidditch Beater, Seeker, and then Quidditch Keeper. Again, these are all $13 a piece, but perfect to go with them is definitely the Hogwarts Quidditch Team Captain Duffel Bag. Perfect for your travels. It's a good oversized one. It does have all four houses for a Harry Potter on the inside. They are $70 a piece, but these patches would look really cool on that. Of course, the Wizarding World of Harry Potter offer also offers spirit jerseys for all four houses. And these are very, very super thin and breathable. It's embroidered Hufflepuff on the back side, but even the pinstriping is embroidered. The front side does have your Hufflepuff badger and the house crest. I do want to come over here to the front side and see what else we have doing. So this one here is your Ravenclaw version. I like how they do like the little pinstriping and the lettering. They don't have the price, but I want to say these are around around $70 a piece. And here's a bunch of brand new items that were just released not too long ago with all the different spells. This graphic t-shirt, Expecto Patronum. You have Lumos, Stupefy, Alohomora, and the Wingardium Leviosa. Those are $37. And then right over here is the adult size, um, let's see here, short sleeve shirt with all the spells. This is perfect for a fancy meal. $70 for them. And it looks like they do even have drinkware part of this collection. This is a very heavy cup, $21. It does have the plastic lid. Let's see what we got going on here in the bottom section though. They do have a pullover hoodie. I like how the spells are just by the chest area. $70 for that. And it looks like they do have the matching lanyards with lanyard pouches. 
Here's the uh, lanyard pouch that is sold separately, $10. And right underneath there is the uh, dual-sided one. This is a very nice lanyard, $16. It has all the spells, and then it shows you casting them on the other side. Also part of the same collection though, they do have a bunch of home items, like this coffee mug. It says Revelio. When you add hot and cold liquid, it does change colors, so it is like heat activated. Let's see the old price of Rooney. That is $25. Underneath there is a brand new serving tray. This one says Lumos, Expecto Patronum, and Wingardium Leviosa. I really like the uh, shape of this. Very unique. $30 for that. And then right over here are your dinner size plates. These are actually pretty deep. They have all the spells going around the entire perimeter. Those are $19. Let's check out some of the other items that they do have part of this collection. This is a women's shirt. I love the whole design here on the bottom section, but everything is embroidered. Look at the feathers and all of these squiggly patterns. It says Wingardium Leviosa. It actually shows you how to cast a spell in the parks with your interactive wand. Those are $40. And then right underneath there, they have a very soft pair of leggings with all the different spells at the Wizarding World for $45. And I can't hype up backpacks enough, especially for the theme parks this is a perfect size now this one's not a lounge fly but it's a pretty much the same size of a lounge fly it has a clear pouch on the front with a zipper compartment and you can see all the different spells even the spells are up here on the top section but check out the straps they say the spells on the straps and then you do get some hardware those are $65 a piece and then right underneath there you have some Wizarding World of Harry Potter um, gold tone like bangle bracelets for $25. They do have like matching pairs of earrings here with all the various spells at the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. And I did want to mention the signage. Purchase a universal merchandise shopping gift card and get a free wand, a $65 value. You do have to purchase a $300 gift card, but that is a great deal. How awesome is the theming? I feel like we're in potions class right now at the Wizarding World of Harry Potter with the cauldrons, the books, the candles, and right underneath there is all of your Hogwarts, like Housecrest gear, like this adult-sized graphic t-shirt. These, let's see here, are $30 a piece. Then right over here is your full zip hoodie. Again, right now it's definitely too warm for these. It is a very heavy material. So if you're from up north, this is a great buy for $70. And they do have two different drinkware offerings over in this spot. This one's actually wrapped in a simulated leather with the metal medallion with the Hogwarts house crest. That one is $25. And it does look like they do have the matching coffee mug part of this collection, but the shape and size is really cool. Again, with the Hogwarts house crest, it says Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry on the backside. These are $21. Even some really cool clear glass drinkware that they do have. And if you look closely, you can actually see all the different Hogwarts houses from Gryffindor, Ravenclaw, Slytherin. The backside says Wizarding World of Harry Potter and Universal Studios. That taller mug is $19. And they do have two different other size glass here. $14.95 for this tall one. And again, it has all the Hogwarts houses. It even says Universal Studios on the backside. So really nice attention to detail. Here's a much shorter size cup. Again, with the Hogwarts houses, $17. Underneath there is the knitted pattern throw pillow. This is super duper soft. These are $35. And if you do like the knitted merchandise, they do have a very nice like woven tapestry throw blanket with all four Hogwarts houses for $85. On the opposite side of the Hogwarts rack, how about this four by six photo frame that they have? It's wooden and then you get the resin Hogwarts castle at the bottom section. These are $27 a piece. We own this, it's very nice quality. They have the original packaging though. And they do have some resin statues up here in this upper section. A really good size Hogwarts castle. You can see it like propped up on top of the mountains. And it says Wizarding World on the bottom side for $39. They do also have the Wizarding World of Harry Potter snow globes. These are $49. But you can't go wrong with some snow falling on top of Hogwarts castle. How cool is that?
even some really fun designer items that they do have. So these are Wizarding World of Harry Potter Danielle Nicole fanny packs. These feature the quilted pattern, you have the embroidered Ravenclaw logo, two different zipper compartments on the front, and it says Danielle Nicole on the back side. These are $58. Underneath there is your Hufflepuff version, but what I love what they did with this collection, they do also have the uh, matching full-size backpacks. These are $98, but some amazing quality. Again, with that quilted pattern, you do have an extra zipper compartment on the front and it's embroidered Ravenclaw. Underneath there is the Hufflepuff version. I do want to see if they have the other houses though. Okay, so over on the opposite side of the rack is the matching Gryffindor fanny pack. Again, with the lion, the Gryffindor logo, Danielle Nicole items for $58. They do have the Slytherin version of the fanny pack right underneath. And also the adult size backpacks. They do have the other two houses with Gryffindor and Slytherin. You could even purchase your platform nine and three quarters Hogwarts Express merchandise like this wooden wall sign nine and three quarters You get the Hogwarts house crest and Hogwarts Express. That's $47 I'm actually wearing this t-shirt right here. I can definitely tell you very very soft They say Wizarding World of Harry Potter on the inside you have nine and three quarters Then it says platform nine and three quarters Hogwarts on the sleeve $37 for the adult size and they do have the kids version of the same graphic t-shirt shirt for 25 let's actually come over here to the opposite side though and see what else we can find so this is a little book of Harry Potter travel magic these are artifacts from the wizarding world here's a bunch of different things you get on the back side look at the chocolate frog you get Luna Lovegood spectra specs these are $29 and they do have the platform nine and three quarters pullover hoodies where everything is embroidered on the front again these are adult size for $70 again I feel like the throw pillows at the wizarding world of Harry Potter are unmatched like this is a cool one it's in the shape of like a button it says platform nine and three quarters everything is embroidered that is $37. I do want to show you the opposite side though. So it's double sided. It's embroidered Hogwarts Railways. And then you do have the Hogwarts House Crest. So very nice attention to detail. Underneath there though, you have to look everywhere. They have things tucked away. This is the Hogwarts Railway a coffee mug with the same design on both sides for $17. You could even purchase some of the brand new Deathly Hollows merchandise and they do have a good amount of drinkware. It says uh, longing, humility, Let's see power on the inside of there and I do like what they did with the Deathly Hollow symbol The shape of the handle is really cool. These are $21 right next door They do have the plastic drinkware offerings with that same design It says the Deathly Hollows and then Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Those are $12 a piece Underneath there is an adult size graphic t-shirt with the Deathly Hollows logo. These do go up to size 3X, $37. On the back side there's no design, but that's a super soft material. And they do have like a windbreaker material jacket. This has a Deathly Hollows logo, but if you unzip it a little bit, how fancy is that design on the inside? These are $90 a piece. I do want to show you some of the other Deathly Hollows offerings that they have. They do have a throw pillow for $37. Again, this is a nice knitted material and super duper soft. Right next door is a Deathly Hollows backpack. This is a little bit smaller than your lounge fly size, but look at the material that they use with the attachments to make the logo. That is really creative. Let's see the old price of Rooney. Those are $65. Underneath there are two different Deathly Hollows baseball caps that they have. This one's in embroidered with your classic design. It does say the Deathly Hollows on the back side. $27 for that one. And I don't think I've seen this one before. This is like a velvety material. Look at the little rope attachment with the fancy Deathly Hollows logo. That one is $27. They even have you covered here with a fancy meal at the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Here's a long sleeve button down shirt with all the Deathly Hollows logos. A very soft material. These are $70 a piece. And then right next door, how about the sequence long sleeve sweatshirt that they have? All of the sequences on both of the sleeves from the shoulder all the way down. And you do have the black sequence Deathly Hollow symbol for $65. And then right up ahead is your classic. I do believe these are glow in the dark. Deathly Hollows coffee mugs. Again, the shape and size is incredible. $21 for that. I did want to mention though, there's a brand new store here at the main Universal Studios store, the House of Mina Lima. We'll check out that merchandise in just a bit. 
You can purchase some really highly, or I should say high-end collectibles here as well from the Noble Collection. They have the Matthew Lewis autographed 8x10 who played Neville Longbottom with his wand. This comes all framed and matted for $8.75. Here's some items from the Noble Collection, like some bookends. They have the Basilisk, $58. And over here is a really awesome one with Dobby when he pulled the uh, sock out of the, let's see here, Tom Marvolo Riddle uh, Diary, $120 for that. Underneath there are a couple other Noble Collection offerings like the Dobby bookends for $60. They do actually have the diary with the Basilisk Fang going through it. It comes with the display stand for $85. And then underneath there you can even purchase some of the different brooms, the Nimbus 2000, Nimbus 2001, and the Firebolt. These are all $65. They do come with the display stands which is really neat. Underneath there in the case, they also have the Sword of Gryffindor that comes mounted onto that plaque. It does say Godric Gryffindor and Harry Potter, $215. And then right over here, they do have Lucius Malfoy's walking stick from the Noble Collection. That's $150. And then how about Hagrid's umbrella wand? They even have that for $120. Let's check out the brand new Wizarding World of Harry Potter store that they do have. This is the House of Mina Lima. They did lots of the artworks for the Wizarding World of Harry Potter and the movie franchise. Some really cool photo ops with all of the letters to Harry Potter, which is really, really awesome. And how about this? Like they have the chocolate frog, advanced potions. They have platform nine and three quarters. They actually did the Hogwarts, um, let's see here, tickets as well. Let's dive right in though and check out some of the offerings. They do have the magnet set. It says Mr. H. Potter, the cupboard under the stairs. That is such a classic part of the movie. That is $12 and a good amount of different magnet sets. This has all the different uh, classes and books like the uh, Advanced Potions, Tales of Beetle the Bard, Fantastic Beast, and Hogwarts Artifacts. These are $20 a piece. It does look like they do actually have a couple different sets. Like this one here is the Daily Profit, ver profit version. You have Dumbledore, a Dafter Dangerous, He Who Must Not Be Named. I love these though, Undesirable Number One. Even a brand new Cinch Backpack. This is very, very cool. The uh, material is super duper soft. It says Mina Lima here on the tag. Okay, actually, this is a uh, cushion cover. So this is actually for a pillow. Oh boy, okay, so that is $45. And here's a couple different books that they do have. So these are filled with uh, 20 different postcards inside of these books. $20 a piece though, they have Weasley Wizard Wheezes. They have the Marauder's Map version. Like I said, you get 20 postcards inside of these books. Like that is a great deal. The Advanced Potions one is really neat. But they do also have like some greeting cards here as well. They say Harry Potter on the backside. So this is like the uh, Sirius Black wallpaper. How cool is that? This is really neat. The uh, Black Family Tapestry, it says, all $6 a piece. You can get the uh, London to Hogwarts one way, a uh, platform nine and three quarters for $6. And it looks like they do have one literally with an entire map of Hogwarts. And it looks like they do actually have some tote bags here in the bottom section. I knew it wasn't going crazy. They do have the tote bags. This is the cauldron version, uh, $26. And look at the stars here on the straps. It does say House of Mina Lima. They do have the Harry Potter Undesirable Number 1. That one is $26. Also, the Sirius Black Family Tree one is really cool. These tote bags are super duper soft. I do want to show you some of the other cards that they have. Like these are lenticular. It says new headmaster for Hogwarts Sirius Snape or Severus Snape confirmed. These again are $6 a piece. They do have the boy who lived. And speaking of Sirius Black, how about this one? Have you seen this wizard? And they have Bellatrix Lestrange. And right behind me is a good selection of Christmas ornaments. These are all different prices. You have Christmas at Hogwarts with Hedwig, and then you have Hogwarts Castle. They do say Wizarding World on the back side. This one here is also wooden with the presents. You have Hedwig and Happy Christmas. These ones over here do have the prices though. This one's $25 with Hedwig carrying some Christmas presents. They do have a snow globe version for $22. This is metal, and you can actually see all the snow on the inside. The 
bottom section says Christmas at Hogwarts for $22. This one is really adorable though. It's a very glittery, glittery snowflake. You have Hogwarts Castle and then Hedwig on there. That one is $19. Let's see what else we got doing though. So they do have the Birdie Bots Every Flavored Beans, one of the classic snacks at the Wizarding World. It says Wizarding World to Harry Potter on the backside. Those are $15. This one is my favorite though. We actually have this on our Christmas tree for uh, last year. This is the Marauders map one. It does open up. You can see like the footprints. These are $22 a piece. Really nice quality. It's a very heavy metal. It has a little button on the backside you can push and actually see the footsteps moving. Let's see what else we got doing here though. Okay, so this is way cool. The Monster Book of Monsters. Very nice attention to detail with the teeth and the tongue coming out the side. And it says Wizarding World on the backside for $25. You can even purchase some of the different neckties. They do have all four houses. Look at that though. It comes on a really cool little hanger with a bead. Those are $17 a piece. And they do even have Harry Potter's Christmas sweater. A very soft material that comes on the hanger for $22. And it looks like they do even still have some of the Christmas merchandise left over from last year. This is the adult size long sleeve shirt. It says Christmas at Hogwarts with the platform nine and three quarters wreath. You do also have Hedwig. These are $70 a piece and they do have a couple different offerings here of the Christmas candles with Christmas at Hogwarts. This one is the uh, Frosted Pines. Right next door they do have the orange nutmeg and then the gingerbread. These are all $28 a piece. Of course, you can even purchase some of your Wizarding World of Harry Potter snacks like the Chocolate Frogs. And they do come in dark chocolate and milk chocolate. $14 a piece or three for $35. They do come with the Wizarding cards inside though. So definitely check out for the hologram. Right next door is your collector's keepsake. These come in a tin and you actually get five Wizarding cards. This is a nice uh, metal tin that says Chocolate Frog. And you do get the huge Chocolate Frog on the inside. Those are $30 a piece. But how about underneath there? How about these chocolate frog Christmas ornaments? The insignia looks incredible. The frog actually smells like chocolate. These are $24 and they even have one with the chocolate frog packaging. They even have a little section dedicated to Harry Potter and then uh, Honey Dukes. How about this Harry Potter lounge fly bag that they have with all the Honey Duke snacks like the, you have the like the Beatles, you have the Birdie Bots Every Flavored Beans. The zipper pull though does say Honey Dukes. This is very nice quality. I do want to see if we could find one here with the original price tag. That one is, let's see here, $82. Right next door they do have the Birdie Bots Every Flavored Bean purses. Again, and you can see all of the beans and it does come with the metal hardware so this is like a crossbody size for $55 that's actually on sale normally $80 and they're running a deal here 30% off your Wizarding World Honey Dukes jewelry so they do have a bracelet set with all of the assorted snacks these are really really fun though and a pair of earrings let's see how much the earrings are these are originally $25 and they do have another bracelet literally just with the Honey Dukes logo but I don't feel like you need any Anything else like that's perfect underneath there if you're uh, into some of the Wizarding World candy definitely check out the Birdie Bots every flavored beans you never know what you're gonna get like you might get soap you might get earwax vomit grass all sorts of different flavors those are $13 it looks like they are running deals on lots of the Honey Dukes merchandise. These plates are normally $17 each, but when you buy four, you can purchase four for $45. And just like the chocolate frog we had with the collector's tin, they do have the Birdie Bots Every Flavored Bean and the uh, metal tins for $25. Here's a bunch of new merchandise for Hagrid's Magical Creatures Motorbike Adventure over in Islands of Adventure. This is a graphic t-shirt with all of the characters. You have Fluffy down there. Look at the uh, Cornish Pixies and Hagrid. Those are $25 for the kids shirts. They do have a wood grained uh, water bottle. These are a very tall cup. Again with that same design as the t-shirt with the Pixies. And it says Hagrid's Magical Creature Motorbike Adventure. Those are $25. And right over here is a bucket hat. 
Oh, this one's reversible. It says Hagrid's on the inside, and then you have all the magical creatures. This is brand new to the Wizarding World. For $45 on the opposite side of the rack, this is like a crossbody size bag. It has a little attachment that says Hagrid's, and this is really good though, a perfect size for the parks. Like you can put a water bottle on the inside. It has the drawstring. Those are $45 a piece. Then underneath there is the adult size graphic t-shirt for Hagrid's, also brand new. That is $33. And then the backside, how cool is this design? Again, with Hagrid's Magical Creatures Motorbike Adventure. Even a good little assortment here of plushies from Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. How adorable are these baby nifflers? All $18 a piece. Actually looks like they have three different versions. These are super duper soft. Very, very cool. Underneath there, they do have the posable, uh, bendable bow truckles. Very nice attention to detail. The card he comes on is really cool. That is $15. Also from Fantastic Beast and Where to Find Them. This is another lounge fly bag. Very nice attention to detail again. This is a huge zipper compartment with all of the uh, Niffler's findings that he found. You have some little uh, faux leather tootsies here. Very nice though. These are $82 and super duper soft like the material. Underneath there is the matching lounge fly wallet that they do have. You can see all the different coins that the Niffler collected and it has a batch badge on the backside for Fantastic Beast. These are $55. I do also want to show some of the plushies that they have. So this is like the photo op that they have over in Hogsmeade with the snowman wearing the uh, Gryffindor scarf. Those are $22 a piece. And here's a really awesome teddy bear plushie. You have a big teddy bear wearing the uh, the house robe for Gryffindor. It's even embroidered Harry Potter on the little Tootsie there. Those are $40. I love that they're now selling the paperback books here for the Harry Potter franchise. These are all $13 to $15 a piece. They have the Sorcerer's Stone, the Chamber of Seekers, uh, Secrets, a Prisoner of Azkaban. Underneath there is the Goblet of Fire, the Half-Blood Prince, and then the Deathly Hollows. This one is a much larger size book compared to the other ones. And they do have some really neat like collector's ink pens and bookmark sets. These don't have the price on them, but they have a bunch of really cool characters from Draco Malfoy, Severus Snape. It actually comes with a wand ink pen, which is really neat. They have Ginny Weasley, Luna Lovegood, and then finishing off the collection, they have Narcissa Malfoy. Let's also check out the spinny rack that they have with assorted pins, and these are all a great deal. It says Free the House Elves with Dobby. That one is $9. Looks like they do actually have an entire assortment here of Dobby pins. This one, Dobby's holding the sock. It says Dobby is free. $11. Underneath there is the Hogwarts alumni. That actually matches all that merchandise that we saw. $9 for that. And here is uh, Fluffy the three-headed dog. Really cool. It's on all that brand new Hagrid's merchandise that we just saw for $9. Underneath there you have the uh, classic signage there with the hand pointing towards Nocturne Alley over at Diagon Alley. That is $9. Let's see what else we got doing here though. They have the Deathly Hollow symbol. I love that fancy design. This matches those uh, t-shirts and things that we saw. $12 for that one. And here's one even specific just to uh, Diagon Alley. You can see Gringotts Bank. They do have so many different pins though for the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Here's all four Hogwarts houses. It looks like you get five different pins. They say like Gryffindor, Keeper, Seeker, Beater, and then Chaser. Of course, these are for Quidditch. These are $22, but they do have all four houses there. Then underneath here are some very intricate ones that I haven't seen before. This is the Gryffindor logo with Godric Gryffindor's sword for $11. I like the different attachments these come with though. Like, how cool is the Slytherin one for $11? Ravenclaw comes with a diadem, which is really neat. I don't think they have the Hufflepuff version. It looks like they replaced it with this one, but these three are really nice. Of course, you can even purchase all four of the different house robes. These are $139 for your wizard robes. This whole section is Hufflepuff. It has the huge patch on the front. Again, $139. These are very, very accurate to the movie, though. Like, you could see the color on the inside. And then each robe actually has a little pocket on the inside as well, where you can put your interactive wand. Definitely cool for safekeeping in the parks if you're casting any spells. Right up ahead, they do have the house robe uh, backpack for $88 with the tie. This is the Hufflepuff version, again, with the simulated leather. Those are $88. And again, these are Danielle Nicole and a bunch of assorted winter wear. We're definitely out of that season right now. But this scarf has lots of frillies. You have the badger and it says Hufflepuff in a big graphic 
for $40. They do have the matching beanies and gloves. Look at the little uh, frilly ball on the top. This one's embroidered Hufflepuff on the bottom, but the uh, hat is 30, the glove set is 22, but they even have like the more screen accurate scarves that do say Wizarding World of Harry Potter on the inside. Those are $40. They have the ties to go with the robes for 39. Like I was saying though, they do have special compartments here with all four houses. They have the Gryffindor section with the hat, the gloves, the scarves. Here is the house robe that you can get also. The uh, backpack house robe. This is cool though, $88 for that. You have your Gryffindor um, house robes as well for $139. And also the uh, fancy Gryffindor scarves. They have the neckties in the bottom section, even the headbands. It's the same material as the necktie. These are $22. And then one section over is all of your Slytherin merchandise, again with the winter wear. They have the hat and gloves. Over here is your Slytherin scarf. The snake looks really cool though, like he's embroidered on there. They do have the, um, let's see here, scarf. And again, this is that heavy knitted material for $40. Underneath there are your Slytherin neckties and headbands bands and they even have some matching Slytherin scrunchies. These are $15 a piece but this material with like the neckties and everything is super duper soft. I had such a fun time today hanging out here at Universal Studios City Walk at the main Universal Studios store. They do have a great collection of everything from Universal Studios Florida to over at Universal's Islands of Adventure commemorating 25 years. Wizarding World of Harry Potter, an enormous selection in there. The Cat in the Hat, Simpsons, Transformers, a little bit of everything. That being said, if you are interested and any of the merchandise in today's video, definitely check out our Patreon page. The link to that is in the description box. But if you like today's video, give it a big thumbs up. And as always, make today awesome.